everyone welcome back to brand new video and on this video i'm gonna be showing you how to root any android device without using a computer without unlocking bootloader of your android device without using any custom recover like ttap urb or anything like that and the method that i'm going to be showing you is gonna work on any android phone on any android version without using a computer without unlocking bootloader of your android device which is pretty easy to do the method that i'm going to be showing you it's 100 percent easy and safe to do it won't harm your device and it won't a uh, prick your phone so before this video i want to ask you if you are not subscribed to my channel subscribe to my channel give the notification to get notified about new video and let's get started so as i just said the method that i'm going to be showing you is going to work on any android phone on any android version and that you won't need a computer to do this process to have root access on your android device by using the method that i'm gonna be showing you you won't need a computer you won't need to install ttwrb or any custom recover like ttwrb you won't need to unlock a bootloader of your android device you won't lose anything in your android device but first of all let's start by making some change on your android device open the setting of your android device i'm gonna be uh, we are going to make some change on your Android device. First of all, open the setting of your Android device. Scroll down to the last option about phone or about device or system. TZM find the option saying the a uh, build the number, just like this. Build the number. Click on it around seven times to, to activate the developer option. Click on build the number around seven times to enable the developer option. By doing that, you will unlock a the developer option. Once you have enabled the developer option, just return. TZM find the option saying developer option. I have already unlocked the developer option. Click on it on the developer option, just like this. Click on it. It's going to be just like this. If your developer option is disabled, just like mine, as you can see, it's disabled. Enable by clicking right over here in the corner and this icon, the corner. Click on it to enable. Click OK if you ask you. All right, scroll down. Cheesy and find this option saying USB debugging mode right over here. USB debugging mode. Click on it to enable this option. Go ahead press ok if you ask you scroll down we are going to enable one more option all right here on window animation skill make sure to a uh, mark the animation skill just like i did 0.5 x just like this click on it to mark it and transition animation skill do the same as i did as you can see animation skill 0.5 x Make sure to mark it, click on it to do that. In animation trash skill, do the same as I did, click on it to a uh, enable this one over here. This option animation scale mark it as 0.5x. Click on it. Make sure to mark this option saying force GB rendering. TZM find this option saying force GB render click on it to mark it by clicking right over here in the corner and this icon to mark it. Scroll down. Again mark this option saying force 4 x m s a a Mark this option as well. Alright. Now I'm going to be showing you that my handle has no root access. To do that, I'm gonna be using the application called root shaker. To find out that my Android has no root access, you can do that if you want to know if your phone has root access. Download in this application on Play Store, root shaker, install it on your Android device. Don't worry, the application is 100% safe. It's a one hour in your device, it's just going to verify the phone. It's gonna tell you if you have root access or not. You install the root shaker on your Android device, open it up by clicking on open to open the application from Play Store. If you want, I leave the link in the description of this app in the description of this video. The link of this app will be available in the description of this video. Anyway, download the application, install it on your Android device. It's going to be just like this. Just click on agree to proceed with the installation. Alright, a swap to the right to a 
proceed swap again to the right to proceed and click right over here on get started click on it the application is going to be just like this as you can see the device name the android version that i'm using android 8 android audio which i'm using to verify your phone if it has root it's just to click right over here and verify root by doing that the application will start to verify and it's gonna automatically tell you if your phone has root assets or not just click on it by doing that the application will start to verify just to wait a little bit it won't take too long it's only going to verify the phone it's gonna tell you as you can see uh, the application is saying sorry root assets is not properly installed on this device on my device root assets not installed on my device enter the area device name as you can see root assets not installed okay all right now everybody know that my phone has no root assets now let's proceed with the tutorial download the one more application the link will be available in the description of this video the app that we're going to be using will be available in the description of this video the application that we're going to be using to a uh, get root assets on our android device easily without using a computer will be available in the description of this video download installed on your rented device don't worry about it the application is 100 percent safe it has no virus just download it on your rented device This application will be available in the description of this video. It's the app that we're going to be using to get root ACS on our Android device without using a computer, without hiring our Android device, without unlocking bootload. Just click it on it to install on your phone. Alright, install the application and open it up by clicking on open. The application is going to be just like this. As I just said, the link will be available in the description of this video. Alright, install the app, open the app, it's going to be just like this. What you're going to do just to click right over here on agree to proceed with the installation. Don't worry, the application give you all the permission to the app by clicking on allow. Don't worry, the application is one hundred device. While you're installing the application, you might be facing this kind of pop-up. Just to click right over here, go to setting to give you all the permission to the application click right over here permission to run over other apps don't worry just to give you all the control to the app it won't hurt your device all right now what you're going to do just to wait a little bit the application is now initializing it won't take too long just one minute or two minutes depending on your device just to wait a little bit All right, the application is has initialized. All right, what we're going to do now just to uh, make some change on this a uh, send box. Then just to click right over here on system by clicking on the setting or uh, the system icon. Getting the setting of the send box. Scroll down to the last option. We are going through the same process that we did on the start about phone or about device. Is the last option. Clicking on it. TZM find the option. Same build the number, click on it around seven times to activate the developer option around seven times. By doing that, you will be able to unlock the developer option just to return. TZM find the option saying developer option just like this. Click on it, scroll down. TZM find this option USB debugging mode. Make sure to enable just to enable to turn toward it's just a normal step scroll down one more time make sure to a uh, uh, set the animation scale uh, to 0.5x do the same with the transition animation animation duration do the same Sc scroll down cheesy and find this option saying force gpu rendering enabled and enable this option saying for c for x m s a a enabled by clicking on it return you can return now all right now just a uh, click right over here on this icon saying 80 apps just clicking on it 
we are going to install some application we are going to install the root shaker here these are all the application which are installed on your Android device what we're going to do if you want to install one one of this application on the send the pocket stick the ground over here on it and the application will be automatically installed on send the box we want to install the root shaker tzm find the root shaker on this list just to click around over here on just to click around over here on root shaker on eight i mean click around over here on eight right over here in the corner to install the application on the send box all right the application is started just to return so you can see we have installed the root shaker on sandbox now clicking on this to open the root shaker we are going to do the same process as we did on the start to verify the phone if it has root assets or not click it over here on agree as we didn't start agree to proceed with the installation scroll down i mean a swap to the right swap to the right one more time you are over here on get started Okay, as I just said, we're going to do the same process. Click right over here on verify root by doing that's the application we start verifying and it's gonna tell you if your phone has root access or not. Just click on it. Alright, as you can see, super user request me permission to the root shaker. If this is happening to you as well, make sure to do this. A hey, mark the first the last option saying remember choice forever just like this is just like I did remember choice forever click on it and click right over here on allow right over here in the corner <laughs> well as you can see congratulation Ruti SS is probably installed on this device without using a computer without using any custom recovery like ttab or b without unlocking put loser of my android device without a losing anything installed on my device without having my device easy and simple okay guys i will start from here I hope this video help you out if this video help you out of course subscribe to my channel leave the notification to get notified about new video leave a like and i see you guys on the next one peace out